All right, guys, today I have a little app review here for you, and this is called Neon Alarm. And I'm just going to show it to you. Basically, you have a clock here in the circle in the center, just your normal clock. You can see it's the same as what I have on the top up there. Um, and then you have alarms up here along the top, and you can see those right up there that you can drag and kind of maneuver. You can swipe up, and it'll get rid of them. You can swipe back down, and then obviously left and right to look at them. So how this works is if you um, swipe one down like that, it turns it on. You can see on the notification bar that you have one turned on right there. And it does those little Z snoring looking thing, which is a pretty cool little animation as well. If you tap it once you've turned it on, it'll bring it into the edit screen here. And you can edit the time here by moving this little dial, um, which is pretty slick. And it kind of vibrates as you do this. And then you can select the time, and again, you know, you know 50's up here, it's just like a, a wall clock, 5's over here, you know, 30's at the bottom. Um, and then if you want to change AM, PM, you just adjust right there. So we'll set 11.30 PM, and then when you're done, just hit the checkbox. And now that alarm is set for that time, and you can turn it on and off just by doing that little quick swipe with your finger, which is pretty simple. Um, I like it a lot. Let's go ahead and check this though really quick. You can go into edit and this is all of your settings in here. So it tells you it's active. So your alarm is set. It's got the time. Motion controls is basically if you want to shake your device left and right, um, it will turn off an alarm. You can pick your default uh, ring for it or notification. Some other settings here. Repeat is right here. So you can say yes or no and set up how many days you want it to repeat on uh, that exact same alarm then you down here at the bottom you have vibration which i leave as yes and you even have snooze so if you want to hit the snooze button it will uh, go ahead and snooze for as many minutes as you have it set to um, those are pretty much the settings on it this is a pretty basic application here i'll show you and turn on a couple more of them um, pretty uh, simple and easy to use for setting up an alarm and the easiest part is that you can just turn them on and off with just this little flick uh, which is just nice a nice little uh, feature on there to do it as well the clock doesn't do anything right here uh, when you click on it so it's all right um, I haven't found personally a way to add any more than four alarms uh, it's maybe I'm missing something that's uh, I'm not really sure but from what I could see I couldn't f add any more than those four and you can repeat them on days. So, I mean, you have, you know, it's still quite a few alarms. And normally most people only use like maybe one or two alarms a day anyway. So it's not really a huge issue. Uh, but anyway, there you go. That is uh, my little review here of Neon Alarm. Uh, really cool little app. I'll probably put a link to it in the video description of this video. If you guys like this video uh, or anything else... Uh, you know, i got other videos just like this, other app reviews and things like that. Um, you know, please check me out at RootJunkie.com, or you can follow me at Facebook or Twitter. I'll put all that stuff in the video description down below. That's it. That's my review of Neon Alarm. Hope you guys like it. Root Junkie out.